might be over, but the holiday shopping season certainly is not. The National Retail Federation said 70% of consumers plan to shop after Christmas and take advantage of those post-holiday sales. The other big reason to shop? gift cards. Meanwhile, as a lot of people turn to these big retailers for holiday shopping, there are small local businesses which need your support too. The cost to start up and maintain a space, create something, well, can certainly make getting off the ground a big challenge. CBS 17's reporter Judith Bertana introduces us to a Raleigh man who's removing these hurdles for new business owners. The traditional co-working spaces are more for, you know, the just the office space or internet, whereas uh, many business owners complained of needing a place to go create. And that's where Johnny Hackett Jr. steps in. He runs the factory, Raleigh's first co-manufacturing space. It eliminates the challenge of finding a place to create. Then we've removed another hurdle in terms of accessing this equipment that you need to create those products. The factory has the equipment and computer software for entrepreneurs to use for everything from candle making, t-shirts, photography, or digital design. A survey from Shopify found business owners spend an average of $40,000 in their first year, much of that going to space and equipment. For a smaller fee, businesses can come here. As a new business owner with just an idea, you can literally come here and get that idea off the ground. When business owners are done creating their products, they can bring them here to Hackett Storefront Black Friday Market, where their products are sold commission-free. It's another way Hackett is building connections and filling in gaps for business owners. The owner behind Therapeutic Bath Salt is one of those who creates at the factory and sells at Black Friday Market. She is literally here um, all the time, sun up to sundown, making products. Um, I've seen uh, her train and show other folks how to make those products. Hackett says they've helped nearly 100 businesses. And in the last four months, those entrepreneurs have sold more than $250,000 worth of product. We just want to do our part for small business owners in retail. In Raleigh, Judith Rattana, CBS 17 News.